Hello everybody, it's Vertical Sandwich, and welcome back to Hailfire Peaks. I have a plan, uh, a nefarious plan. Uh, I also just watched a bunch of the, not the whole thing, but a bunch of the movie The Labyrinth, so maybe that'll sneak in. In 9 hours and 23 minutes, you will be mine. Anyway, uh, let's, uh, let's go over to the ice side. Uh, by Wumba. I want to get the transformation stuff out of the way for my nefarious plan. Because it's nefarious. Okay, she's over here. Now, okay, the transformation in w for Wumba is... Ugh, it's obnoxious. It's really obnoxious. And I'll explain why. I'll show you why. Anyway, we got Globo. Um... Oh, yeah, that's right. He says that for Mumbo. Sure, I'll just throw it in. All right, do it. Just do it, Banjo. <laughs> All right, and we are transformed into... A snowball. A Wumba called the snowball. So does the rest of the English-speaking world, Wumba. <laughs> Thank you. All right, you start with one health as the snowball. You have a, a charge attack with B. And as you roll around, you gain life and get bigger. You can't get through this space uh, with anything more than, uh, than two life. Three life, you can't get through. But you can take damage in the water here, which is what I always have to do. What you're meant to do, by the way, I'll show you before we do that. What you're meant to do is use the fire next to Wumba's to melt yourself. But again, can never quite get that to work. I always get the third one right before the door. So this area over here is easier for me. Alright, one more. There we go. Crap. Oh no! Let me through there. Okay. Hey, we took out a Yeti. Awesome. It's only when you're rolling around in the snow, by the way, that you... Alright, so now we have to get up here. And there we go! We've opened the train station on the ice side of Hailfire Peaks. Which, fantastic. Alright, so that's one thing. If we go up here... And, uh, you know, charging is not absolutely necessary, but it does, you know... It does allow you to... Uh, you know... Do things. It does allow you to uh, beat up enemies, which is nice. Okay, there's a Jinjo here, guarded by wind. And what you have to do is make your way to him along this right wall as the biggest snowball. Yeah, maybe we messed it up. Ha <laughs> ha! You're dead. I think if we slowly make our way in there. There we go. Fantastic. And now the wind stops. So now we've just got to get back where we came from. Which conveniently, there's a ramp here. All right, so now uh, this one's gonna be a little. This is a little trickier. Oh, jeez, really? I thought I was on the pad. All 
Oh, crap. I can't remember which way we have to go. We may die doing this. Not a big deal. But, I really can't remember. This is not it. It's got to be over here. Yeah, it is. It's right over here, up this hill, and then back over to the cold side. You sh actually shouldn't really uh, lose a life there. You can charge right through. But now, ugh. There we go. We need to be at full life for this, so. Now this will, uh open up the switch here. We need to move from this level, though. Let's see if there's anything worth digging up down there. So that's it. That should be everything we need to do with the snowball in this stupid level. I believe. Now we can't, uh, yeah, we can't get that, that jiggy, um, without, uh, using, uh, without using the banjo move that we haven't gotten from this level. Because I've just been busy doing everything else. But now I think, oh, and I'm hoping that this is everything we have to do with the stupid snowball. <laughs> I like how they just ran to their deaths. You know what, buddy? There. Take that. I don't have to take this crap from any of you. Okay. So there we are. And now we actually can use the fire. Alright. And in we go. So, uh, that's all our snowball stuff. We did that in a really good amount of time. I like that. I made it look easy, but it's, uh, well, it's pretty easy. It's one of those things. It's hard if you don't know what you're doing, but if you know what you're doing, you're fine. So now I'm actually going to leave Hailfire Peaks now. Uh, because we're done with that, I hope. Oh, if we're not, it's, I'm going to, if we're not, I'm going to cause you guys and myself, well, myself more than you. Uh, a ton of paint. Because I'll have to leave again. But on the upside, uh, we will be able to... No, wait a minute. And it's weird that there isn't a, a, there isn't a, a world entry and en exit thing here. So, what we're going to do is we're going to leave the world, which, by the way, is these stairs, which is kind of cool. Because I thought about it the first time I had to leave. I was like, I don't remember coming in. Like, I don't remember what it looked like to get in here. And what we're going to do is we're going to go back to Spiral Mountain and get our fourth cheat. This will all work out really well, actually. Because once we enter the cheat, we can go straight from Mayhem Temple back to the kickball stadium. Yeah, isn't it crazy? I've been playing this long enough. I know where, like, I know where the uh, the entrance to Spiral Mountain is and stuff. Like, just by popping out of the. But whatever. That's what happens, I guess. I suppose. I presume. My grandmother would would have said, "I presume." She would probably still say that if she had her mind, but she she doesn't. Oh, let's not get all sad and everything. Okay, so Cheeto, we have six Cheeto pay. Really? That's surprising. You got enough pages for me to tell you a new cheat. Now this is a controversial cheat. We're gonna use it, but. Fourth cheat is Honeyback. 
Honeyback automatically replenishes your honeycombs at an astoundingly fast rate. It essentially makes you invincible. It's ridiculous. So, I know people have... The general consensus in the community of people who love this game and play this game is that using this in, in the final boss is, uh, just, uh, is just cheating. Alright. So, uh... But we are going to use it in the rest of Hellfire Peaks and the next level. The, now, the problem with it is because it replenishes... Your honeycombs, if you have it on while you're the snowman, it makes it impossible for you to get out of that little area. Because even using the water like I was using, um, you still, you will gain... Actually, if you get in the water, it will replenish um, honeycombs at exactly the same rate the water takes them away. It's really obnoxious. It also makes it largely impossible to kill yourself with, like, the lava. It's very strange. Maybe not impossible, but close. Oh, you know what? I pushed near Wumba's Wiggle Bomb and then was like, what am I doing? And then realized that was exactly what I was supposed to do. Shoot at me. Ha! <laughs> Too slow. All right, honey back. Well, if we have, uh, if we have one, um, Cheeto page left, that means there's only one to get out of Hailfire Peaks and three out of the next level. So, and one of them in the next level is monstrous, monstrous. I say, I got it in practice though. So there we go, honey back. Automatically replenish your energy over time. Like over no time. It's it really is. You'll see how fast this I'm gonna I'm gonna get hit on purpose in here. Okay. There we go, we got one back. We got one back. We got one back. And it's really quick. Ridiculously quick. So it's gonna it's gonna break the second dragon fight in Hellfire Peaks. I'm okay with that. That enemy can't hit us because we're in a menu. <laughs> All right, Kickball Stadium. Now, I know of... Uh, we really need to... Okay, we're in Hellfire Peaks. What I really need to do is... I, I know... Okay. I've got to think about what we need to do here. We're going to get all ten jiggies. We're going to get everything out of Hellfire Peaks. We have one more move to get. Uh, I'm not... I know... Okay, I know where the last Jinjo is. Uh, we'll go through... I can think of two Jiggies off the top of my head that we haven't gotten. But, I mean, like I said, we'll get all ten. So now we just have to get back to an area where we can, you know... Okay, we'll take one from the lava. Get it right back. So ridiculous. Alright, well we know where we are. Uh, so, when we come back, more of this everybody. Bye.